What's up, y'all? So I was notified by Sketch the Journalist, a Christian rap slash hip hop historian of Houston, Texas, and even other coasts. He he's just a, a historian of Christian rap in general, and he has memorabilia, um, you know, a big collection of Christian rap music, and he's a writer and um, journalist. That's why his name is Scheduled Journalist. Plus, he can draw. He made, like, some comic strips before. Um, so if you didn't know that about him, or if you don't even know who he is, check him out. Uh, he's on Facebook and Twitter and all that, uh, and Instagram. Sketch the Journalist, or Sketch the J. But uh, anyways, he's a fan of Grape Tree Records, you know, uh new wine was actually part of that so that's what this video is about he he's he was a christian rapper and then he started doing like worldly rap and and then he's it looks like he might be trying to get back into doing christian rap again and i want to explain that you know in the last song i i did a reaction to it was true vine talking about you know you know if you fell fell down try to you know come back to god don't run away from him and I talked about there being two different types of people. You know, there's the kind that grew up in church but didn't really know Jesus as their Savior. They were, like, living under, I guess, the law and, and not grace. And they just started to really rebel and, and they fell away and got away from church and stuff like that. And then there's the other kind that, you know, the the second type of person that, you know, has... A relationship with God and they fell and they struggle with sin and stuff according to Romans 7 you know but the Bible says the righteous fall sometimes and get back up so um good morning, good morning. I'm doing a video yeah but uh but yeah you know Everyone sins, everybody messes up, so I don't know his heart, and I don't know his music that, that well, you know, from the past, and what exactly happened, and, you know, how he fell so hard, and so far, and, you know, straight off, you know, but God's grace and mercy is beyond what we know or measure, and Rhea Blash talks about that all the time, and, you know, and so God brings his children home, you know, if they are his children. And so um, maybe this is new wine coming home, you know. Maybe he's like the prodigal child, you know, that, that he was enjoying the comforts of of his father's house, enjoying the company of people like Bill Rascal and, and others, and, and just, you know, wanted something else for a little bit. And, and then... You know, maybe God was trying to correct him and 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 stuff, or 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 something. I I really I couldn't explain it. It's his testimony, his story in the making, and um and so my hope is is New Wine continues to do Christian rap and gets you know close to God and stays close and stuff. Um, but uh yeah i'm about to play this song and before that though i would like to say that guy true vine from the last song rhymes with new wine and it would be pretty cool if new wine and true vine collaborated uh if you haven't heard of true vine play my last song and also look up some of his music i would say that some of their styles is is kind of similar in a way or you know they could both definitely fit each other's style and do some crazy cool collabs you know and in fact it'd be cool if they became a duo or something like social club misfits or something but uh they they both have that uh interesting voice characteristics that would make them a great duo new wine and true vine uh you know, if you hear his song Church in the Streets featuring Literati, that was one of my favorites that, you know, True Vine and then New Wines, um, I don't know any song but this one because 
um, he does have songs with Grape Tree, but I haven't really listened to a whole bunch of them, maybe one or two, and so I need to, to get some more Grape Tree, uh, I, I got some, um, God's Original Gangsters, uh, and other artists that are on one of the, um, Grape Tree, um, I guess mixes that I ordered from eBay, you can actually look up some of this old school Christian rap hip hop and find it on eBay and Amazon and order the physical CD copy and even vinyls sometimes. So I'd encourage y'all to look for these artists if you want to find some old school hip hop to add to your collections and um, to showcase and even jam to to play. You know, it's what what good is it if it's just sitting in your you know, collection or whatever, and not ever being played, I mean, there obviously is digital copies and stuff, I mean, um, I, I wouldn't blame you if you did want to keep it as a collector's item, I mean, I'm sure Sketch does that too, you know, he keeps stuff for just the sake of collecting and stuff, but I'm sure he plays some of his stuff too, um, it, it probably depends on what it is and who it's from and stuff like that. Um, but look around Sketches thing. You'll you'll find a lot of new artists or older artists to listen to if you check out Sketch. But I'm going to play this video because it's already six minutes in. I just wanted to kind of talk about this before I started playing it. Uh, but I'll, I'll let it play out now. I want to tell the world to be nice. To work over and friendly to one, one another. Uh, I tell the world that I, I want to love God for Him. Caroline 
is four years old. Wow. What about you, uh, Sabia? Sophia and Hibba. Pretty cool. So he was talking about GPS tracker. I think think that he was talking about, you know, God doesn't lose you. He knows where you are. And then the other part, God a whooping, you know, God gives you correction and, and wants you to go the right way. So, um, so yeah, uh, I mean, I, I hopefully that's the right, right interpretation. But anyways, um, like I was saying, I think it would be cool if New Wine and True Vine got together. I don't know how you can get in contact with True Vine, but um, I'm sure somebody knows him and can let him know that it'd be tight if he did a collaboration. Um, so I couldn't find him on social media, but I'm sure somebody can get in touch and somebody on the streets probably knows him you know some of these people that that associated with him like Lid Roddy and Sketch the Journalist and other artists that I like they probably have some kind of contact with him um so we'll see you know like um just pray for New Wine and that he'll continue wanting to do music and, and find you know some connections with you know, other artists that are Christians and make some new music, you know, jamming music. And, um, yeah, 